This is Eric Mwadi with Mwadi.com. Let's take a look at Amazon and this is a one-year daily chart. And I want to discuss the idea of playing breakouts and how some breakouts are actually designed to be traps. All right, let's take a look at a previous breakout that took place on, the, on this daily chart. So this was the daily closing high and we have a nice breakout attempt. In fact, it closes above the prior daily closing high. So this is a good breakout. But you'll notice it fails almost immediately. Right here. Now, I bring that up because right now we are looking at a situation where we have a breakout attempt. Above a recent daily closing high. So for now, traders are playing this as a breakout. right here and it so happens that the breakout level is one six nine six point two zero and I'll come back to this in a second so all right so the question is right now there's a breakout how can we tell at some point that it's time to get out of this breakout if things don't work out so there are two things if we go back to the previous example here we see that number one there was a failed daily breakout. That was your first warning sign. And then number two, we can use the RSI in the following fashion. You can see that if we come and figure out where we broke down, coming off the highs, RSI break, corresponding with that movement of the RSI, we draw our uniformity line. something like that and we can see how this was instrumental in giving us a reversal here of that high and again notice that when we fail to break out here it also corresponded with a failed move above the line in other words this became resistance right here which was your second red flag so right now if we see that it is moving below 16 9 6 in other words if we see a failed price breakout that would be our first red flag the second red flag would come if this is also confirmed as resistance in other words if the rsi does not confirm a breakout without a price without the rsi breaking out chances are this could also be where we see a reversal as far as the stock is concerned but for a reversal to take place the first thing we need to see is a failed breakout above this price in other words it needs to move above this price for there to be a warning that there is a potential move that's going to take place moving the stock potentially to the downside with the understanding that right now this rsi level might be a problem something to watch for those who are playing the current daily breakout just like it was a problem here during the previous breakout attempt this could also be where we see resistance now we're going to take a look at the two hourly here in a minute notice here we have this reversal again corresponding with this rsi resistance on our uniformity resistance line right so let's take a look at what happened early in december if we take a look at the two hourly and you'll notice the two hourly was coming to a level of potential resistance based on this break here coming off the highs of september draw our uniformity resistance line notice in early december this was uniform activity rejection and now we are coming again showing potential resistance around here that's why I'm saying hour to hour, day to day, it makes more sense for this to be where we see a pullback as far as Amazon is concerned. Eric Mwadith, Mother.com, as always, good luck, peace, and blessings. E-A-C-S. Woo!